Hey everyone, it's CL. So I'm a little bit stressed out right now because my travel plans have suddenly changed. We are expecting rain from Thursday through Christmas. And if you've ever driven in Southern California, the 405 freeway, the 5 freeway, it can get completely crazy with rush hour traffic, with rain, with um, with it being cold because that creates like icy roads. So I was supposed to start travel on Thursday, but I'm actually going to change it to tomorrow, which expedites my timeline by a day. But now I feel like I'm not ready. I am that person that likes to be very prepared. I like to have a plan. I like to know that plan well in advance. You know, honestly, I think that's an anxiety thing because I don't like surprises. I like to have a plan. So I have to pack up everything today and I'm like, will everything fit in the car? What things do I need to do around the home before I leave? I like to make the bed, take out the trash, all those little details before I leave. When I come back home, it's like really fresh and clean and then I lay in the bed, it just feels so amazing. I had two cups of coffee and I'm feeling really tired still. I'm trying to remind myself to not stress out, just do what I can. But I need to take my blood pressure. You ever have that feeling where you just feel a little bit off? I wanna take my blood pressure and make sure that that's in normal range because I feel, when I say I'm tired, like yes, I feel tired, but I also feel like not normal right now. Like I don't know if it's just anxiety. I don't know if it's adrenaline from the coffee I drank, but I wanna take my blood pressure just to make sure that it's normal because I don't feel normal right now. So so right now it's about 3 p.m. I need to finish up work. Um, I need to start packing. I need to do yet another load of laundry. Does anybody else feel like they're constantly in laundry hell? Like no matter how many loads I do, there's like always more laundry. So I need to do a, maybe one more load of laundry because so essentially when I get to my dad's house I am pretty much going to eat a lot of food I'm gonna lounge on his couch he has one of those fancy couches where it reclines really far back and there's a charger there's a phone charger attached to the couch it's one of those couches where there's like no reason to get up and move unless you have to go to the bathroom so that is what I'm planning to do this Christmas holiday I'm just gonna lounge around and it's been so long since I've done that so I'm really really looking forward to it but we have to get through this whole travel process I think I will be able to relax once I get there I found it I have the CVS pharmacy version of a blood pressure monitor 122 over 82 not the best so my blood pressure was a little bit elevated. Normally it's in the 112, 116 range, but I was reading that drinking coffee does elevate your blood pressure. So I'm hoping that's why it was, it was a little bit higher than normal. But anyways, I am of the opinion that everybody should have a blood pressure monitor, something that's worth checking regularly. You might think that you're the healthiest person in the world, but you never know, you know? Stress can really affect people differently. Some people can handle stress better than others, but regardless, it's, it's definitely important to have your own blood pressure monitor, go to the doctor regularly, and just, you know, advocate for your own health. So depending where I'm going and whether I'm flying or taking the car, I am very particular with what bags I use when traveling, whether whether it be my rolling luggage or a duffel. So this here is one of my favorite travel bags. Um, I mostly use this for carry-on when I take flight. So this trip we are driving, but look at the, look how cute this is. Isn't that super cute? You got a little space kitty. I love the design. Since we are driving to see family, I know 100% we are gonna bring things back like presents and we're gonna bring back a lot of food. So I want something small and compact to make it easier to play Tetris in the car. Like this can easily fit on the floor in front of one of the seats so we can use like more um, space within our trunk. All right, so I got a lot of things done. There's still a lot left to do, but right now I need to pause and make dinner and for dinner tonight, we're having some chicken, which I'm gonna coat in some panko breadcrumbs. And my daughter likes her chicken with rice. I am trying not to eat rice, it's so hard. But I'm going to cut up some bell peppers and saute them, and I'm gonna eat my chicken um, with some tortillas. Mm -hmm. 